Hey, how you doing? Phil here. Welcome back to Hide and Geek. This is a continuation of our mini-series of the little indie city-building game called Islanders. And as you might have noticed, I decided not to play it island by island. I've done a few islands off-screen, just to get a bit more acquainted with the game. Then I decided to start the campaign all over, not to have all those advanced structures all at once. So, this is what we have. This is the second island of a new campaign. So, okay, let's let's do it. We have a lumber pack and a farming pack here, as usual, as always. And this is an island rich in lumber. 16, 17 is best. I think I saw 17 there. Very good. Plus 10, plus 9, not too good. Plus 15. Ooh, plus 18 points. And a little sawmill. And we have a pretty nice combo here. Now. A brewing pack. A brewing pack for hmm where should we put the brewing pack maybe maybe right over here like this because why not And another sawmill and is this a prosperous industry or what very nice let's set up our first city center let's first set up like a smaller city center on this side of the island yeah let's do it I haven't really thought this through but and this one is going to be mainly composed of houses with not so many mansions. Like that. And a farming pack to boot. No, let's stick a masonry. Some masonry will do us good. I'm trying to align those houses perfectly, but I don't think it's possible. Okay, is that okay? It's close enough. So then this one goes here. And we have a pretty little city square. Very nice. Okay, now. Shaman. Shaman. Sh shaman. Oh, this place is going to be just perfect for a shaman. Look at this, 40, 42 points for this little guy. I count that as a success. Very good. Very nice. Now, 36. I think that was, uh, yeah, that's, that's the perfect spot, secondary spot. 36 points for the second shaman. These are like... These are like competing shamans, living on the same mountain, brewing the same magical potions, but trying to put one another out of the business. What is wrong with you, house? I think it's it might be too close to the water here, so let's stick one here. I love it! It's looking pretty awesome. We can start building... Another city center over here Like this and this one will have some mansions attached to it Will that be enough for a fountain? I hope so. I sincerely hope so because I have built I've tried to build fountains in uh, In the closest possible vicinity of a city center like so many times and each and every time I misaligned it by like a millimeter. Think of it out of the box. Where should we put this one? If we put this one here, we won't have a fountain inside. So 
I don't want to do that. This looks like a good idea. And we'll have a little plaza over here, too. At least I hope so. Okay, and we do have a fountain already. Will it fit? Of course it won't. Oh, of course it won't. They never do. They just never, never, ever do. Let's have a fountain over here, then. 27 points for this guy? I think I'll take it. 27 points seems a fair amount of points. Do we have space for another field here? Of course we don't. Huts. Yes. Huts get bonuses from... From shaman. Shamans. How do you... What, what is the plural for of shaman? Shamans. Shaman eye. I don't know. I don't care. Let's have a couple of huts. Oh, not a couple of huts, just just this single hut. Okay. Okay. I don't have a problem with this. Nice. Parks. This is what I needed. Okay, this one fits fits like a glove. Very nice. How about a little fountain here? Because I really Totally forgot about this, uh, this part of the city. Nice. Ooh, a plateau. This gets us additional... What, living space? Just just like that? What, what does this do? It just looks cool. Okay. I'm... I'm totally fine with that. Let's have a plateau. And a couple of mansions around it. Hmm, maybe like this? Yeah, why not? And this little park, maybe just in front of the city center, yeah. That's good. Another house to complete our little green square. And a few huts. Well, no, one, one hut. Another one. Pretty good. Mm, a tower. Temple, mason, statue, mansion, park, wall, house. Okay, so we got 27 points from this tower. 21, 28 points if it's right here. And that's one point more, and it looks pretty, so let's go with that. And another hut over here, just for the point. Do we have any more profitable place? Yes, yes we do. Oh, actually, we, we do. 12 points for this little guy. Very nice. Some more houses. This is shaping up to be one pretty, pretty little town. Although the amount of pawns here is a bit... It's a bit too much for my liking. Alright, another mansion. Where, or oh, where should we put it? Oh, this looks like a nice place for a mansion. We can also plop down another another city center, but do we want to do that? I don't think so. We'll keep it for later. Warehouse. Warehouse. Ooh, did you see that? 
30, 38. I think that's, yeah. This, this is what we were looking for. 38 points. Let's put it down here. Now we have another tower. And this tower will not be as profitable as the first one, I think. No, it won't. Although this might actually be a pretty nice, neat spot for a tower. Now this looks really cool. Let's expand our city block a bit. Do the same to our mansion, to the to the more affluent part of the city. Oh, the thin little park. I was waiting for that one. We can fit it inside of here. 23 points. Bam. Very, very nice. Do we have another place like this? I don't think so. We'll leave it for later then. And pick some more of those. So, a circus. See, a, the circus hates the mansions. The, the rich people hate the circus. But look at this. The little peasants here love the circus. I mean, who doesn't? Does this mean I'm a peasant? I, I might be. I might be. Who doesn't love the circus? How about we place another mansion on this side of the... Whoops. On this side of the plateau this time. Ooh, a gold mine. Let's check this thing out. It wants to have a gold vein, a warehouse, a jeweler. Okay, let's go with the gold mine here, the warehouse here, and the jeweler. Right here on the on the mountain. Oh no, I thought we will get 30 points for that. And we didn't. My bad. I must have misunderstood something. Unfortunate. But it's not the end of the world. We still get to expand our beautiful city uh town town block over here. Oh man, I'd really like to put something over here. But I guess I won't be able to. So let's just stick with the original plan. And the original plan was to ooh, have a market, apparently. Ooh, 40, 52, 60. Well, we won't do any better than that. Okay, we just did. 64. Wow. 64 points for a single building? That, that has to be some kind of a new high score. We're making loads of points for this island. I love it. Maybe I'll get a mansion over here, another one over here, a little fountain between those guys. This is looking better and better. Now, Resort Oasis needs hop fields, plateaus, fountains, parks, water plateaus. Water plateaus, wow. Statues, flowers, fields, breweries, fishers. Um, let's get this guy. 
I'm not sure where to put it. Oh, minus 50. <laughs> a minus 100. <laughs> I'm tempted to, to plop it down here just for the kicks. But no. So, um, what does this do? Okay, we get 15 points from from this. Let's get the 15 points and call it a day, shall we? Strange little thing. Can we stick the tower up on this plateau? We can't. But we can put it over here. And this... That works for me. Ooh, I can fit this thin little park between the circus and our town square. And our town block, I mean, I'm sorry. Now this city, this is what I call a city. This is looking awesome. A tavern now. That might be interesting. Brewery, city center, statue, and house. Ooh, we'll get a lot of points from this one. So 59 points for this. Yes. Oh, yes. The people love their beer. Oh, yes, they do. Anyhow, I think we're out of space. We're out of space here. We're nearing, at least. Let's have this one house. Maybe we'll stick another hut inside. Yeah, like this. Like... 15 points, okay. I'm good with that. Now, let's focus a bit more on this side of the town. Ooh, a temple. Is that a big house? Oh, it is. Oh, yeah, it is. And apparently we, do, we don't have the... We don't have the space for that. Why is it minus 60? Like, this, this does not make sense. Minus 75. That's the basic score for this? That is strange. I think we should build another um, another city center here. And then stick the temple somewhere somewhere around somewhere around this. This one is going to be like the mixed city block. With uh, both the houses and the mansions. And the warehouses stop being profitable, which is a pity. Ooh, a wall? Will we ever have a place to fit this anywhere? Let's check it out. Like like this. Okay. Hmm. That's that's totally new for me. The wall is I saw a space here. Come on, I saw the space here. Man, it was it was oh, okay here. 14 points. It looks like crap though. We would have to Or maybe we shall enclose this from from this side. That's okay. That looks good. And that would make sense. The rich guys in the mansions wouldn't have, wouldn't want to have anything in common with the commoners. Now would they? But they will have to have everything in, in common with the commoners in this part of town. Do we get to stick this in here? Yeah! Cool. Now, a water plateau. I was waiting for this one. I saw this in one of the trailers, and I wanted to see how this... We can stick it on... We don't have to stick it in the... In the water. 
but obviously we can. This is too high. I mean, I would like to have this on the level of the houses. Not so high. I guess we'll build it over here then, maybe? Nah. Nah, it doesn't look good. Let's leave it for now. I haven't got an idea for this. So I just keep plopping down buildings mindlessly without thinking about the purpose of that. Or maybe it's time to call it quits. Maybe it's time to call it a day. Huh? We have a beautiful city over here. And I'm honestly starting to get a bit bored by uh, by developing the whole the, this whole island. So, yeah, I think it's time we moved on. The third island and the third episode await. So guys, I hope this was uh, at least a bit entertaining. And thank you very much for watching this. I really hope to see you around for the next episode. Stay safe out there. Have a great day and see you around.